Welcome people, to a new TF2 video. With the fixed TF2 event the word about the hacker bots has been spreading, we all know the main issue of this, but the video gamer magazine made a very interesting interview to the user Megascutterbot, which you may remember some time ago for working on a community and to cheat. Exploring this issue further, the user explained his experience with bot hosters, where he says that his website and TF2 server received constant DOS attacks. The website shows individual nodes of real players divided in normal players, suspicious and confirmed cheaters. With this information and the announce of the project, bot hosters and cheaters started to slander him, with fake screenshots, spreading false rumors and even fake AI voice models, trained and used to spew slurs on the game voice chat. He mentions that he laughs at many of the things that happened, but he also has his low points. One of the most serious actions was the bomb threat. Someone under the real name of Mega Scatterbum made a fake bomb threat towards his university, receiving the visit of two police officers and having to explain the whole situation about people pretending to be him. However, they're not just focusing on specific people, they like to advertise bots immunity services, where if you pay a fee the bots won't target you, needless to say this is also a scam from bot hosters. As we can see the bots problem it's not only they are ruining the experience, behind this there are people who go to illegal extremes of harassment and scamming players, which is something that the recent movement has also wanted to show, a problem that is not only limited to the game, but to real criminals. Let's hope if now with the 300,000 signatures there may be more visibility of this problem, and the community in Tijit project achieves a great future. Subscribe for more TF2 videos.